WooCommerce is the most popular plugin for creating online stores on the WordPress platform. Its widespread acclaim stems from a robust set of features that facilitate shopping cart management, purchase orders, and the handling of both buyers and products. Additionally, a thriving ecosystem has developed around WooCommerce, with hundreds of developers creating products that enhance its functionality and extend its reach. In this video, we will demonstrate how our Calculated Fields Form plugin seamlessly integrates with WooCommerce products to dynamically calculate prices. Our plugin also allows shoppers to input additional information, which can be included in both the shopping cart and order details. While WooCommerce does support variable products with assigned prices for different variations, these options can be somewhat limited. To illustrate the integration process, Let's consider a specific use case that can be applied to any WooCommerce product. Imagine we sell tiles and we have a product in our store called Tile Price Per Square Meter. To provide a more professional and comprehensive service to our customers, we want to enable them to enter the length and width of the area they wish to cover. The product will then automatically calculate the required square meters and the total cost for flooring coverage. To achieve this, we will create a form as usual this form will include two numerical fields for entering the width and length of the area, along with a calculated field to compute the area using the formula, with multiplied by the length. Since the price set in the WooCommerce product configuration is for one square meter, the next step is to calculate the total price by multiplying the calculated area by the product price. When creating the form, we don't need to know the exact product price up front. Instead, we will use the variable WooCommerce underscore specific underscore product underscore price generated by the calculated fields form WooCommerce add-on, available in the developer and platinum versions of the plugin. This variable will contain the price of the product associated with the form, allowing us to use the same form across multiple products in our store. Finally, we will designate the field that calculates the final price using the request cost attribute in the form settings. Once the form is created, we need to integrate it into the WooCommerce product. The first step is to enable the Calculated Fields Form WooCommerce add-on. To do this, navigate to the add-ons menu option. Check the Calculated Fields Form WooCommerce option in the add-on listing and click the Activate slash Deactivate Add-ons button. This action will introduce a new section in the WooCommerce product settings, allowing us to associate the form with the product. Next. We will edit the product and, in the new configuration area, select the form we created earlier. We will also check the box that enables price calculation through the form. At this point, all that remains is to test the product. 